video is about driving a left-hand car in the UK. That's what you're coming for, but that's what you're coming for, but we don't want to let you in. You talk it back to the floor, you're asking what's happening. It's getting late now, hey now, enough of the arguments. She sips the Coca-Cola, she can't tell the difference yet. How is it to drive a left-hand car where people drive on the other side of the road is actually pretty much the same thing you will get used to it in a couple of days or probably in a couple of hours I brought my car from Russia here you are allowed to drive in the UK with foreign number plates for one year if you are a European or American driver and you come to the UK the first um, couple of things that you need to make sure that you have in your head is the fact that when you're turning you have to turn on the left side of the road um, so here as we can see that we are on a one-way street and I'm about to turn right and it's really important that I think that I am in the UK and I don't turn straight away because that's the oncoming traffic. I have to turn on the left side of the road just like this. The other thing is that when you're going at a roundabout, you have to make sure that you go clockwise, not anti-clockwise. Otherwise, you're going to have an accident. Ah, uh, London roads, London roads. If you want to get a car um, with British number plates, but it's left hand, you have to convert the lights, which is quite expensive as well. However, in Mercedes, there is a menu which allows you to change your positioning of the lights. In the section of light here, we can change dipped beam setting for left side traffic or right side traffic. Welcome and in today's video we are going to show you the worst sounding V12 engine in the world. Dude, this thing has absolutely no exhaust sound. <laughs> Fumble it, I get the bag and flip it and tumble it Straight off the lot, 300 cash In the car came with a blunt in it Little mama a dot, and she got ass And she gon' fuck up a bag Pull up to the spot, living too fast Dropping the dump in the stash In Italy, got too far and hoes they DM me Drop the top, when it's cold but you feel the heat Be real with me, keep it 100 Just be real with me Eat it up like it's a feast They say the dope won't sleep What are the disadvantages of driving a left-hand car? So first of them uh, it is difficult if you're on a single carriageway it's really difficult to overtake because you always have to look like pretty much like this as if you were sitting there able to see other oncoming cars so that's the first one the second one is obviously getting parking tickets because you actually have to get out the car and take the parking ticket another disadvantage is when you are turning right and the oncoming cars are going straight it's going to be really difficult to see those cars Another thing, they are so angry with everyone else in the world, so they think that they have priority over everyone on the road, which is obviously not the case. So if you're driving in London, be careful. Those black, pink, silver, yellow, whatever cabs, they're dangerous. The major drawback of driving in the UK is that English people cannot drive. So what are the advantages? Well, personally, I don't like uh, having my steering wheel on the wrong side of the car so that's just a matter of preference obviously my car isn't registered in UK therefore I don't have to pay congestion charges in London when I do get an occasional parking ticket like it doesn't matter because it's not gonna come to my address because it will probably just get lost in the post or will never get sent anyway the other advantage is if you're in a hurry you can uh, use the bus lane occasionally because again the cameras will probably not even read the number plate so one of the first difference from Europe um, is the fact that in the UK they use miles as well instead of kilometers and some cars for example like this Mercedes you can actually turn your dashboard from kilometers to miles and it also gives you a figure of miles per gallon for the fuel consumption and I still don't understand how it works so overall I'm having a really great experience driving here in the UK I really enjoy it good luck <laughs> Don't let him in, you have to